Well, now to Decision 2016 and today's one-on-one -on -one interview that we did with Republican vice presidential nominee Mike Pence. He campaigned in Mason today, 22 days ahead of the November election. Natalie Tindall with 2 News Investigates caught up with him in an interview you'll see only on 2. I asked Pence directly about the concerns we're hearing from supporters about a rigged election, as well as the possibility of a revolution if his ticket doesn't win. Republican vice presidential candidate Mike Pence wasted no time bringing his supporters up to speed on the news of the day involving opponent Hillary Clinton's emails, which reveal at least one person at the FBI felt pressure from the State Department to declassify some emails. This information, though, gets scant attention, and, and, and attacks on my running mate seem to lead the news almost every night. <laughs> the fight against the national media has been a hot topic over the weekend, even sparking Donald Trump to claim the election is rigged. In a one-on-one -on -one interview, I asked Pence about it. Are you concerned about a rigged election? Well, I think there's no question that the, the bias in the national media is so obvious uh, to the American people. It seems like we get up every day and the national media is uh, doing half of Hillary Clinton's work for her. I think the American people see that and uh, calling out the national media on that, asking them to do a better job the way that the local media does, for providing the kind of balance coverage that you provide on a regular basis uh, is, I, I think, part of this process as well. Do you think there's going to be a revolution if, if your ticket doesn't win again with Trump, you know, Pence supporters? I, I, think the, I, I think the American people are rising up and come election day, we're going to bring real change to this country. But, uh, but in the course of our elections, part of the system that you have here in Ohio, part of what we have in Indiana, is that citizens are encouraged to participate on a precinct by precinct basis in the electoral process. And my message to people today is that, 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 that the right to vote, protecting the integrity of the vote, is at the very bedrock of our democracy. One person, one vote principle uh, is, is at the very center of, uh, of the American experience and in doing all that we can as citizens to ensure that will give us all confidence in the outcome of this election. Democratic VP nominee Tim Kaine will be in Springfield on Wednesday. We'll have complete coverage on WDTN.com and WDTN. In Mason, Natalie Tendel, 2 News, working for you.